Hi everyone, my name is Major Gratton Savage from the Salvation Army here at Arndale and uh, this is Michelle and Michelle is the team leader director of our doorways program which assists people in their needs and Michelle tell us what does the doorway program do here at Arndale? So here in Arndale uh, um, we service the community in a variety of ways. We have the emergency relief program which um, assesses material aid that we have available. Then um, we also have a financial counsellor who's on site who can help people through larger problems in um, debt. We have NILS program, so we have our workers able to assist with applying for a no interest loan. And um, as you can hear in the background, we also have music today with the Just Brass program. And we'll hear a little bit more about that a little bit later. Yeah. And again, that's a program that meets the needs of children learning music. And uh, it's a great little program. Yeah. Michelle, thank you for sharing with us today. It is a challenge and uh, you would probably say that there's been an increased need um, through, COVID, through COVID and coming out of COVID with people looking for assistance. Am I correct? Yes, um, and we have ongoing issues with um, the concerns with interest rates. Whether or not it's impacting people directly at the moment, there's always that um, stress of what's going to happen in the future, how we're going to manage this. So we have had an increase of people coming in inquiring about different um, areas with um, their finances. Yeah. And are we seeing different people come now? I. Uh, yeah, we have. We've had an increase of unemployment um, and some people just struggling to get back into the workforce even though there are some jobs out there. Um, we have a range of mental health um, issues that have increased over this time as well. So um, we have clients from that. We try to um, assist in different ways, so this year we've really focused on the um, community group that meets on a Wednesday morning for morning tea, um, just building activities there so they've got a safe place and they're building their own community amongst themselves. And that would also help with those who are suffering from mental illness, wouldn't it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. certainly. Well, Michelle, thank you for sharing something of you and what you do and your team. It is appreciated. Thank you very much. Thank you. One of the things that we here at the Salvation Army at Arndale have is a Just Brass program. And it teaches primary school students about music. And it is actually very good in helping them to adjust to school. And it has a wonderful way in which they learn not only music, but interpersonal skills, cooperation, and work with others. And it's a tremendous program that we do and we are thankful that we can do it here. Uh, in a couple of weeks they're going to be participating in another fundraiser with another organization in Christmas in June and uh, at the moment there you would have heard them playing some Christmas carols and that's why. It's a good program. We do need your support not only for our emergency relief programs and for the Just Brass but for all the work that Salvation Army does within the community. We see ourselves as being part of the community and trying to enhance the community and changing it in a positive way. And the way you can partner with us is assisting us in doing that. We can only do so much, but the money that is given to the Red Shield yeah, they gotta fix that. is effective in reaching people, creating community, and changing people's lives. So we just want to say thank you very much. And it's a tremendous program that 